Today we celebrate St. Elizabeth Ann Seton. Now there's a familiar name, especially in the U.S. Today we mark the feast of America's first native-born saint, an extraordinary woman by any account. Elizabeth Ann Bailey Seton was a wife, widow, mother, convert, foundress of the first American religious community for women, the Sisters of Charity, and of the first American parish school. All of it came in the space of 46 short years. There is something uniquely American about the former socialite, born two years before the American Revolution. Born into a wealthy family, Elizabeth married a successful businessman, saw her husband lose his fortune and die young, experienced disapproval for leaving the Episcopal Church, and struggled to keep her family together by drawing on her talents and her desire to serve humanity. Elizabeth was invited to open a girls' school in Baltimore, which she did in 1808. Within one year, she had founded a religious community of women whose members devoted themselves to teaching and serving the poor. Mother Seton knew disappointment, death, and pain throughout her life, but she turned to God and found God at every point. Canonized by Pope Paul VI in 1975, she is buried in Emmitsburg, Maryland.